guys. I'm going to show you the animal signs we learn in lesson four. So first, the general sign for animal, take a flat hand, bend it a little bit, and then put it on your chest and move it in and out. It almost looks like wings flapping, but it's actually, I think, meant to show lungs contracting and expanding as if you're breathing. So this is the general sign for animal. Okay. I'm going to show you some pets and kind of everyday animals we see around the house. So cat, use your uh, index finger and thumb to show whiskers of a cat. Cat. The next one is dog. So uh, you can do a snap for dog. You can do a pat on your leg, or you can do both, a snap and a pat. Sorry, you can't see me patting my leg, but I am just patting the outer side of my thigh. Mostly for babies, I just show the, a pat. That's easier for them. Most babies can't really do the snapping motion, so pat for dog. Okay. Bug, you take three fingers, index, middle, and thumb. You put the thumb on your nose, and then you move your index and middle fingers up and down as if to show antenna of a bug. Spider, you take both your hands, you link your pinky finger, and you show your legs moving. So you have eight little spider legs moving. Actually, I think you have nine when you do it this way. Spider. Mouse, take your index finger and flick the tip of your nose as if to show a mouse sniffing out cheese. Mouse. Okay? Mouse. Bird. Take your index and your thumb, just like you did for cat, but instead you're going to put it next to your mouth and show like a beak opening and closing. Bird. Okay. And then duck is very similar, except you use your whole hand, close your fingers together, quack, quack, quack. Okay, so this is to show the bigger bell of a duck. And then chicken, you use the same sign that you just did for bird, except you put your hand out and you show the chicken pecking on the ground, like chicken peck. Okay, so chicken. Um, next we have sea animals. So we have fish, fish, octopus. Put your octopus head on your hand and then you move it down through the water. So you have your head here and your tentacles here. Octopus, octopus. Okay. Shark, put a flat hand on top of your head and you show your shark fin, shark. That was a fun one. And then whale, put your hand, your left or your non-dominant hand flat in front of you as if to show um, like the horizon of a body of water. And then you have your W hand jumping in and out of the water. This is whale. Whale is jumping in and out of the water. Okay. Next we have some zoo or uh, wild animals. So we have elephant. Elephant you can do with your C hand or with a curved kind of flat hand. I like to do a C hand, but whatever feels more natural to you, you're gonna outline the trunk, so elephant. Or you can do it with this hand, elephant. Okay, then we have monkey. Like you're scratching your sides like a monkey does. Ooh, ah, 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 ah. Monkey. And then bear. Cross your hands in front of you and you're gonna scratch your sides like a bear clawing his chest or like a bear hug, okay, bear. Okay, then we have some farm animals. So we have cow. Take your Y hand, put it, your thumb on your temple, and twist. This is like to show uh, like a longhorn cow, kind of, okay? Horse is really similar, except instead of a Y hand, make your H hand, put your thumb, and then flap your, your fingers as if to show ears flapping. So this is horse, okay? Um, sheep. Sheep is a little funny. You take your uh, non-dominant hand, you lay your uh, V hand backwards on your arm and you cut up as if you're shearing a sheep. So sheep, sheep. Looks like this from the top, sheep. Um, goat, you take your V hand and bend your fingers and then you show like a goat's beard and a goat's horns. So it goes goat. So here you're putting your palm on your forehead, goat. And then pig. Pig, you put your hand under your chin and you flap your fingers up and down. So this one I think of like a pig being up to his chin in mud. Pig. And you want to use your whole hand because dirty is actually like a wiggling of your fingers open. Um, so with pig, you want to make sure you, you do your whole hand with your fingers closed together. Pig. Okay, 
So that's it for our animal signs. Thanks guys.